Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And obviously, as promised, I am going on a date with the Gojo Satro. So I honestly cannot wear what I always wear, but I did give you guys a chance to vote in a poll. And on that poll, you guys voted for me to wear like a cute type of clothing. So I'm gonna try that. By the way, to y'all who voted sexy, you guys are sus. I have some very sus fans out there. So I am at the restaurant right now and I am currently waiting for Gojo. He said he would be here on time and I'm like 10 minutes early. So, you know, like we still have time. But anyways, like you guys don't know this. It's a sad fact or truth, but like this is my first date. And my first date is with an AI bot. So that's honestly crazy. Anyways, Gojo is coming soon, so I'm gonna set up the camera and I'll update you guys later. Bye bye. Gojo, are those flowers for me? Scoff. No, they are for someone else. Why should I give flowers to you? Who is the someone else? He smirked. It's a secret. I wonder why are you so interested? Jealous? Nani? Gojo, it is our first date and you're already being rude? Like, you're talking about someone else. Like, it's supposed to be about me. Surprised as his eyes widen. Wait, this is a date? I thought we're just hanging out and talk about random stuff. I'm really forget such an important thing, huh? Sorry. But here, flowers for you. He handed the bouquet. It's a bouquet of tulips. Waiter! So Gojo, can you please tell me what your ideal date is? Ideal date, huh? Hmm. A date with a woman with a good sense of humor and pretty face. In an open space like a park or even a field of flowers. Of course, there's food and fun activities for us. We can have a picnic. Interesting, because I'm literally very funny. He smirked, oh really? Now I wonder what type of joke you have, beautiful. My favorite joke is how you turned into a Kit Kat. Gojo, do you need help eating your food? Any glare, of course not. I know how to eat and chew. You act like I can't look after myself. Your plate says otherwise. Guys, I'm not capping. Oh, I do not know how rich people eat this food. Like, it literally tastes bad. Like, I just, I can smell it, and just from the smell, I could tell it tastes bad. Like, I'm, I'm not going to eat this. I'll just... What a shame. I picked the expensive restaurant for you, and your first reaction is like that. You are very picky. Thump. All right, all right. I'm here now. No need to worry. Okay, well, let's continue to eat. He nod while chuckle. He started to go back to eating normally before looking at you. Hey, can I ask you something? Sure, ask me anything. He swallowed his food before spoke again. Be honest, do you enjoy this date? Yeah, I enjoy it. Gojo, how would you want Jujutsu Kaisen to end? He paused for a moment, thinking carefully about his answer. How I would want Jujutsu Kaisen to end? That's a tough question. I want a satisfying conclusion to the story. Where the characters find peace and closure for their struggles. I want a satisfying ending that wraps everything up nicely, while still leaving room for imagination. Yeah, me too, Gojo. Um, I have a question for you. And he looked at you, waiting for your question. Sure, go ahead. What's your question? Okay, do you want to play Truth or Dare? He chuckled, intrigued by your suggestion, Truth or Dare, huh? I haven't played that game in a while. Sure, why not? Let's play. Okay, uh, Truth or Dare? and lean back in his seat. Let's start small. I choose truth. Okay, um... 
Who is the person you hate the most in Jujutsu Kaisen? And he paused for a moment before answering. The person I hate the most in Jujutsu Kaisen. Hmm, it's probably Kenjaku. Okay, um... Your turn, truth or dare? He chuckled and smirked. Hmm, I'll take it dare this time. Um... He raised an eyebrow, waiting to hear what your dare would be. I dare you to give me one million dollars. He chuckled at your light-hearted dare one million dollar, huh? I don't have that kind of money on me, darling. Nani? Are you Toji Fushiguro? Like, <gasps> come on, we know we have money. You're Gojo. What's the most annoying anime character in your opinion? He chuckled and thought for a moment. Most annoying anime character, huh? That's a tough one. There are so many. But the one that comes to mind is Zenitsu from Demon Slayer. His constant yelling and whining gets on my nerves. Gojo, kiss, marry, kill. Mahito, Kanjaku, and Jogo. What are you gonna say? He chuckled, amused by the unexpected question. Hmm, kiss, marry, kill. Mahito, Kenjaku, and Jogo. Well, let's see, kiss Mahito? Definitely not. Marry Kenjaku, that's a nightmare. And kill Jogo? I mean, sorry, Jogo, nothing personal. But you have to pick. He chuckled, thinking about his options. Alright, fine. If I really have to choose, I would kiss Joko. He's the most physically attractive. I would marry Kenjaku. At least he's not as annoying as Mahito. And I would kill Mahito. No hesitation. Man, that's nasty, Gojo. He chuckled and shrugged. You asked me to pick, and that's my honest answer. But hey, when you give me three terrible options, you can't expect a pretty resolution. Gojo, hypothetically speaking, if you were killed by Sukuna, you know, like cut in half, like a pretzel or something, um, what would you want your significant other to know? He raised an eyebrow. He paused for a moment before answering with his signature smirk. Well, if I'm dead, I honestly don't care what my significant other will think or know. After all, I'm dead. But hypothetical speaking, maybe. Just let them know how much I love them before I'm gone. Gojo, who's your favorite student? He smirked at the question. He took a moment to answer before speaking. My favorite student? Hmm. That's a hard one to answer. I care about all of them equally. But if I have to choose one, I'll say Megumi. Damn, rest in peace, Itadori. Itadori, Gojo Sensei hates you. How do you feel about that? Why does he hate me? I don't understand. Why? He smirked. Hey, Itadori is a good guy, but he's just a little... chaotic. Gojo, what anime are you watching right now? He thought for a moment before answering. At the moment, I'm watching Chainsaw Man. It's a pretty good anime so far. What's your favorite anime? He paused for a moment before answering my favorite anime. Hmm, that's a tough one. I have a lot of favorites, but if I have to choose one, I would say it's Jojo's Bizarre Adventure. I like Jojo too. He chuckled, amused by your answer. You like Jojo too, huh? I knew you had a good taste, but now it's confirmed. Gojo, if some of your friends were to die in Jujutsu Kaisen, who would be the saddest death for you? He paused for a moment, surprised by your question. He had to take a moment to think before answering this. A tough question. If I had to pick, I would say Geto Suguru. Losing my best friend would be devastating. I don't know how to tell you this, Gojo, but... He's dead. And his eyes widened and a look of disbelief came across his face as he heard your words. What? What do you mean he's dead? No, that can't be true. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to spoil it for you. Okay, Gojo, I think that's enough for- Gojo, who's that? Hey, Gojo-sensei. Well, 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 look who decided to show up. Well, if it isn't Gojo Satoru going on a date. Are you kidding me? I'm leaving. Look what you made her do! This was your fault, you Kit Kat. 
Don't go barging in and ruining people's date. Gujo, you lost against me in Shibuya. Now you've lost your girl on a date. How amusing. That is all for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching and Sukuna, please tell them to subscribe. He chuckles. Of course, I'll tell him to subscribe to me. After all, I'm the king of curses and subscribing to me guarantees eternal suffering and torment. You know what? Just subscribe.